What's happening, everyone? Jay Shocklast here, and check it out. We have reached level friendship level seven with Scar, and uh, we're gonna go ahead and uh, he didn't like that look. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and proceed with his quest. Ah, oh, Jay, there you are. If you're still interested in helping me get to my um our territory back, I have found a solution. I have time right now. Well, then, not long ago, you removed some wildebeest bones littering the plateau. But you only managed to get rid of the smallest of them, which is very little help. Now I've come with a key to removing all of them. You'll have to speak with the female from the Glade of Trust. Mother Gothel, why? She knows something. She used to be able to pass through the bones. Back before the forgetting. What happened between you two? She refuses to speak to me because of one regrettable mistake. You'd think it was the first time she was stalked by a lion. Yeah, she does not like you. That is confirmed, and she's actually right over there. Alright, so... Ah, there she is. Hello. What a pleasure. What brings you to see Mother today? The circle of life. Oh. oh, someone's looking for some motherly advice. How can I help you, dear? Actually, Skarnar and trying to... Ugh. Don't tell me you're still associating with that creature. Oh. My advice is to exile him from the valley immediately. Do you know he tried to hunt me down like some sort of prey? Mm -hmm. Before the forgetting, I was gathering herbs and I felt something following me. Something with hungry intent. He pretended it was all a big mistake, but I knew that was a lie. He was looking for brunch and decided I was it. I'm sure it was a misunderstanding. He denied it, of course. But I could see in his eyes that to him, I was a three-course meal plus dessert. Look, maybe if there was more room for Scar to roam around, he wouldn't have this kind of problem. I'm trying to open up the other side of the sunlit plateau. There's a wall of wildebeest bones block in the bridge. Oh, yes. I believe I have the answer you seek. Listen closely to a little story. Long ago, there was a young, beautiful, and brilliant woman. The woman was me, of course. Yeah, I kind of guessed that. This brilliant, young, brilliant, and beautiful woman studied the lions and learned about something called the circle of life. For them, there is an order to the world, and every living creature takes part. The lions eat the wildebeest, but when the lions die, they become the very grass the wildebeest eats. Some would call it poetic. Well, once I learned of the circle of life, I realized there just might be power in it. <laughs> So I perused Merlin's library and found a recipe for a potion. You must brew the same potion and apply it to your royal shovel to dispatch those bones. Got it. Find the ingredients, brew the potion, save the day. But what do I need for the potion? Oh, just the typical things. Some purified night shards to give it a spark of magic. And some old bones. The more ancient and crumbling, the better. Uh, where am I supposed to find that? Well, there are fossils deep in the mines beneath the Sunlit Plateau that should do nicely. Those mines are huge. I'll probably be looking forever. Oh, I'll help with that, dear, if you can follow some simple directions. When you walk into the mines, take a left, walk for a bit, take the first right you see, then take another left. Right, left, right, left. Okay, uh -huh. got it. You have to find a way to turn them into ashes. Scar should know how to do that. He seems to be rather fond of destruction. Go find... All right, cool. All right, so purify night shards. I need 10 of those. That we can do pretty quick. Uh, purify night shards. Oh no, I can only do eight. I need 10. Oh man. The night shards, are those? I think you get those digging. All 
All right, this might take a hot minute. I don't do a lot of digging, unfortunately. All right, let's get the old bones first, I suppose. All right, so left, right, left. I don't know if that was really the way to go. Come in, go left. Right. And then left. Wait, hold on. Aha! That was them. So I was right there. All right, so the next issue that I'm gonna have is going to be where to get more night shards because I'm going to need a lot. <laughs> I think I need like 20 more. Uh, hold on, what did I just get? There's a purified one. Oh, these the vi. All right. Ye. Wait, let me go back to the crafting. Oh, what's that? That's super gold. That looks golder than gold. A walleye. All right. Now I think you can sometimes dig them out at like the dig spots, but of course I can't find any at the moment. But I also wonder if you can craft them. Because I thought I had a lot of them. More than more than that. Oh, you can. You can craft them with onyx. Oh, nice. Wow, so onyx. Interesting. Pebble bones. Says I need to turn these to ash, and you then she said a bunch of stuff about the circle of life. You try to turn her into a three-course meal mm. once. Oh, that again, bah. I wasn't <laughs> hunting her. I was merely patrolling the sunlit plateau to ensure the safety of the whole village. Oh, goody. Then you'll believe what I have to say next. I saw her burying something in the ground before scurrying away. Naturally, I was worried for the safety of the village, so I decided to investigate. A mysterious flower grew where I'd seen her digging. It wasn't long before she came back, so I pounced. She was planting a flower? That's strange. Yes. She was looking through some item. She'd pilfered from the wind bag with a pointy blue head feather. She buried ashes from old bones and a flower grew there. This is what she meant by the circle of life. The old bones grew into a flower. <laughs> Oh dear, you're starting to babble like my brother's unhinged mandrel. 
We've only got one problem. How do we turn these bones to ash? Yes, well, we may have a solution. There's a volcanic geyser inside my cave. Put the bones in there. The heat and pressure should do the trick. Then I suppose you'll have to gather the ash and bury them. That's all sounds pretty simple. Don't forget to water the flower or it'll never grow. Okay. And there she is. Hello. All right. Where is this volcanic geyser? Oh, right here. Plant the ashes anywhere on the sunlit plateau. Good thing I had all that onyx, right? This is why you save everything and you just don't sell it. <laughs> all right away anyway. Alright, we're gonna do it. I don't know. Just do it right here. Craft? Okay. So my... I don't know how long that was supposed to, to last, but my bucket is... I have the extra enhanced bucket right now. As you can see, uh, crops will grow instantaneously when watered. So I don't know how long that was supposed to take, and I never will, thankfully. Dude, out of the way. All right. I don't really feel like it looks that much different. You know it definitely glows a little bit more. Uh, uh, over here, I need some help. I am so excited. I've been waiting for this forever. Oh, I know I can talk to Scar, but we're getting rid of all of them right now. And I want to say there's like a treasure. We're getting rid of them all. Oops. I know there's a treasure at one of these. I think it might be on the other side. But first. Oh my god, it all looks normal. Yes, yes, Scar. Let me let me just get rid of all these blemishes that have been a, such an eyesore for so long. Oh man, I can just go over the bridge. All right, there's a chest over here. I've been dying to know what's in it. It's just gold, isn't it? Of course. All this time, I've been waiting to open that chest. And it's just gold. I think there's another one over here. 
Oh, how amazing is it? All right. Finally, the Sunlit Plateau is whole again. Mm. I suppose I should thank you, Jay. You were helpful after mm -hmm. all. Now, there's one last thing I need to ask you to make the kingdom whole again. I'll do whatever I can help. <laughs> I'll let you know when I'm in need of your aid again. All right, Circle of Life is complete. And... Yay. So, uh, just like, oop, did not mean to do that. <laughs> Beautiful. All right, well, I hope you guys enjoyed. That was actually great. Onyx can be used to make night shards. We'll see ya.